and what is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the Brickhead family. I am your humble host. My name is Daddy Brickhead, and I am here with my fun co-host for the evening. And you are? Vanessa. Hey, Vanessa. Welcome back. Thank you. <clears throat> um, you missed out on the, the haunted house. I did, but... I bought my own. Oh, uh, yeah. You bought your own and actually <laughs> built it in like, what, one day and then tore it down and built it in it again and almost built it a second time before we even got our first time done. True story. Yep. Definitely yeah. a true story. Yeah. I was having some <clears throat> issues with the little uh, elevator shaft, the links. Um, so I, my son heard me mention, hey, I got to like take it apart and fix it. And meaning I was like going to take off the top part and, yeah. and he just kind of tipped it over and. Uh, okay, yep. so, so here, then what there the was hell? like figure, and uh, so I'll just tear it down and uh, rebuild. Do it again. Yeah. Uh, what's up, Titanium J52? Hi uh, there. <clears throat> Titanium J will be happy to know I got myself a um, Lego Ninjago set yesterday. He's a huge oh. Ninjago fan. Yeah, you'll be happy to hear that. Uh, yeah, you scored on a sweet set. Yeah, this uh, this has been off the shelves for for a while here. Um, I picked this up at. Kohl's, because yesterday Kohl's reopened, where you could actually go in the store. Yep. And I picked it up for thirty-seven dollars on clearance. Yeah. And right now, if you were to buy it brand new, like off the second sellers, you're paying like what eighty, ninety dollars for it. So. Sounds like a deal to me. Hi, Winter Breaker. <clears throat> hey, Winter Breaker. Uh, but uh, tonight, as you guys can see by the the title of the stream and this thing right up here. Mm-hmm. Uh, I found out today, though, that the Lego store close to us in Gurney Mills mm -hmm. was actually uh, doing pickups where you could order something and uh, pick it up. Awesome. Uh, because I've been looking for the Disney Castle, and I figured when stores would have opened up, I would get to Disney Castle. Right. Well, according to them, Disney Castle has gone everywhere. Uh -oh. So, So you know, I fell back on my second pick that I've been wanting for a long time, and that is the Stranger Things set. Sweet. And it's been out... You know, you can order it off of right. Lego.com for a long time. Yeah, so. I've seen that it's out of stock for a while. <clears throat> so, ladies and gentlemen. Dun, dun, dun. Um, yeah. There we go. Look at that. This Look is set that. 75810. Stranger Things set. And uh, this is ha has to be one of the most controversial, I want to say, Lego sets in really? a long time. Because <laughs> this doesn't seem like a kid show, right? Well, right. You know, actually, it's really funny you mentioned that because I was thinking like, hey, this should be 18 plus as opposed to the haunted house. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> You know, but. Uh, what did they get? 16 plus 16 on this 16 plus. So, okay. Yeah, because, uh, you know, you know, this shows a little bit more on the adult side, I want to say. Yeah. Yeah. Or at least, you know, older kids. Yeah. But yeah. No, I. Yeah. And. I can see the controversy. And uh, correct me if I'm wrong out there in chat. Uh, I believe that. Uh, Lego was contracted to build this set. Was you oh. know like the Netflix or whoever? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Netflix, Netflix. own Stranger Things approached them to have the set built. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah. So. I mean, yep. Um. So tonight we're going to bust open this. Uh, awesome. And this set is really cool looking. It is made up of what? How many pieces? Two thousand two hundred eighty-seven. Wow. And it's called the Upside Down because you can flip it over. And you are in the Upside Down, the home of the Demogorgon. That's pretty cool. Yeah. And uh, it's really cool because you can play with the set one way or the other way. Yeah. So it's like, wow, two in one. <laughs> yep. It goes both ways. Yeah. So uh, we're going to bust it open and uh, check it out. Sweet. And uh, by the way, yes, Chaser Plays, the giveaway winner has been announced. Uh, the winner is on the actual... Um, YouTube channel for Ghost Freaking Talking. And unfortunately, Jack, you didn't win. Uh, Winter Bricker, though, won. And uh, she has since uh, sent her winnings to uh, Butt Chop. So Butt Chop has a Ghost Freaking Talking t shirt coming towards them. Yeah, that was very, uh, very nice of you, Winter Bricker, to re gift that to Butt Chop. So thank all you. Right. So, all right, here we go. I'm going to just dump it all out. Yeah, I'll dump it all out here. Hopefully it doesn't slam on the keyboard or whatever we got going on here. Uh, uh. 
Oh, and of course, box. in uh, Lego fashion, uh, we have the white, the, box. the white box that will contain other more bags. Awesome stuff. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, looks like we'll be busy. Yeah, so uh, it was it was really cool. So we drove probably about an hour and a half to get to the Lego store, uh, but. It was, it was well worth it, and you ended up picking up the, the Flintstone set. Yeah, I got the Flintstone set. Um, I know that, I, you know, I saw it on Target, their website, um, a while ago, and I should have gotten it, but I didn't. And then, of course, it's out of stock on the LEGO website, and it is also not on the Target website anymore. So I figured since we're driving there anyways, um, there we go. figured we'd ask if it was available, and sure enough, it was. So. Uh, and it does make me sad, though. Stickers. Stickers. It's a ton of stickers. For, for an expensive set. Yeah. You think they'd take the extra mile, especially because it is a little pricey. Yeah. Uh, this but. retails for $1.99. 99 so, uh, <laughs> Yeah. So it uh, looks like we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 individual bags. Yes. Um, but And then we know there's bags within bags. Yeah, bags within bags within bags. <laughs> um, With no rhyme or reason either. Like why some are in a bag <laughs> and yeah. why others aren't. Um, so, uh, quick plays. Oh, I don't know. Oh, shit. It is Saturday, isn't it? I'm sorry if I'm streaming over Hoosier. <laughs> I apologize for that. I forgot Saturday nights are Hoosier's night. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Sorry, be... Hoosier. Uh, I guess we got a little excited over yep. here. Yeah, we got excited because we got this. <laughs> Let's build it. I didn't get that set because of the stickers, but I did buy all the minifigs. Ah, oh, okay. Very cool. That's cool. Yeah, it's a ton of stickers. Look at that. I see that. Yeah, it's two sheets. There's two sheets of stickers. At least then we can see. Yeah, that's uh, kind of... You want to go ahead and yep. open it? Okay. And then, yeah, yesterday um, we went to Target. And they had, um, I buy a lot of city sets for my son. And they had, um, I forget what it was, like the Arctic Exploration, the one with yeah, the, the woolly mammoth. The mammoth in it. Um, so we went to scan it because Nick said that was an older set. And I had never seen it there before. And um, yeah, sure enough, it didn't come up with a price. So we took it up to the front. And um they after a few minutes of trying to figure out the price they're like oh it's you know 19 dollars <laughs> i'm like hell yeah yeah so we looked online <laughs> and how much was it um it, it originally came out at 120 okay and then like the re recent resale value is at 75 so so well, tw hey so 20 dollars for that arctic set i think it's 20 dollars just for that woolly mammoth if you want to go out and get the woolly mammoth oh well that's cool so Looking forward to doing that one with uh, my son. So oh, yeah. He'll be excited because I got him, um, what was the set that I just bought? It was like a little tree house. It was like a three-in-one, the one of the creator sets. And uh, after we built it, he's like, man, I want a bigger one <laughs> <laughs> because we just did the haunted house. And yeah, so yeah. he's all about the big sets. Yeah, yeah, because uh, we went to Walmart, it was it the other day, looking for those sets that Brick Blaze said were on sale. And oh, right. and uh, the app said that it actually was the the Spider Man one was in stock, mm -hmm. but uh, we got there and we couldn't find them anywhere. So, right. yeah. so unfortunately, uh, didn't get those sale prices. But you know, no. if you guys are out there, check your and your Kohl's are opening. Uh, Kohl's had a ton of clearance uh, sets. Yeah, they did. And uh, you know, it's it's only a, you know, maybe a small. It was a twenty five. It was twenty five percent off the yeah original price. So they're starting to get a marked down. Yeah. And so you know. Probably in a couple weeks here, you'll see those go on, you know, the extra bonus clearance that they usually do. So, uh, so be on the look. And there's a, what was the sets basically? It was like the Lego Movie 2 movie, uh, sets, um, the Toy Story sets. Yep. Um, they had a few city sets yeah, and they had a couple uh, Star Wars sets too. Yeah, so uh, look out for massive clearance at your Kohl's. Uh, so keep an eye out on that. Uh, just giving you a forewarning. Yeah. Unless you're in the Rockford area, and then don't listen then to what I'm saying. Then stay away. Stay away. Stay away. It's still closed. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Especially you, uh, Dave of Scott's Toys. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, we got, it looks like a couple bags within bag one here. Oh, look at that. And I see that uh, 
Studsidious said that he went to uh, Target today and found a Flintstone set. Oh, nice. But it wasn't in the Lego section. It was randomly in the other toddler section with Lego architecture sets. Really? Oh, interesting. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I've never seen them at our Target before. I The only time I saw it was online. Yeah. But. The toddler section? <laughs> maybe, yeah. Really? Yeah, that is yeah. kind of weird. I thought they all. The only other thing I've seen some of like the girly Lego sets like in the girl aisle, like, you know, one over at Target. But yeah. that's the only like separation I see. No. Uh, <clears throat> that was a, uh, the same happened to me. Oh, so for Blaze. I got the idea set at Target. Nick was with me. Oh, it was the transit. Uh, yeah, he got the. Uh, he came for for Philly Brickfest last spring, and like, like I said, the other Target, you know, had the Flintstones and that like that. Yeah. Uh, and they had the Tron set, and he got the Tron, and it was actually marked down. Oh, cool. And, uh, so now the Tron set is like, that one's gone now. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. So he's, he scored. Yeah, he did. That's uh, awesome. Papa Bear, haven't had a chance to talk to you in forever. Yeah, thank you uh, for popping in. Papa Bear is actually over in Japan. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, he's, uh, he's uh, in in the service and uh, is living over in Japan with him and his family. Wow. Well, thanks so, for joining. Yeah, thank you for, for joining in. Uh, NC Brick says, hello. How's it going? Hey, guys. So it looks like we got two books here. All right. Um, I would assume this is probably for uh, the up, the up, and, and that one's for, for the, the down. down. Oh, check that out! That's kind of cool. So yeah, it is really cool. Right. Oh, look in here! They have pictures of all the little mini figs. Oh, and, nice. Oh, yeah, you got it too. Nice. Yeah, this is pretty cool. So, so should we have a battle? So who can build? Uh, who can build the fastest, fastest set? Fastest set. I don't know. I think I'd smoke ya. <laughs> oh, you think so? <laughs> hey, I almost had my haunted house done. All right. But no, I you know I can't uh, compare because you guys were doing it on stream. So uh, otherwise, you would have had it done before me. <laughs> uh, I bought the duel on Mustafa off of Amazon the other day. It was twenty percent off, so I figured, why not? Exactly. Uh, moving to California. Well, well, welcome back to the stateside, then, uh, Papa Bear. Oh yeah, coming back. Oh nice. Yep, next month. Oh uh, yeah, very cool. Uh, so maybe uh, you guys can get on more of our time zone stuff, and then uh, you can hop on more of these streams and stuff. Yeah. Um, I'm going to get food. I'll check in later. Well, thank you, Brick Blaze. Enjoy your dinner, Brick Blaze. <clears throat> yeah, so if you want, <clears throat> do you want the upper or do you want the, 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 the lower? Oh, uh, you're under. serious, huh? Yeah. Okay, um, whatever. It doesn't matter to me. Um, you probably want the upside down part. Huh? Yeah. You're a little more I'm on more the creepy the, side. I'm more on the dark side. We'll trade. Dark side something, 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 something. So how are we going to do this here with, because um, I know you just dumped out my one bag. I guess uh. just move them over and. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> uh, if you're, I'll take if my you're comfortable parts with over that. here then. Absolutely. So I get to start with bag six then. All right. This is woo, 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 <laughs> woo, woo, woo. Oh, we got our orange brick breaker. Uh, it was a that? bunch of toddler books, a few architecture sets, the Disney castle, and one plus. Whoa, wait the a minute. Disney the castle? Disney castle. At Target? Shut up. When is, what? You no should way. go buy it right now. <laughs> <laughs> no way. For Nick. There's no way the Disney at Target. <laughs> yeah, Target. You're, you're blowing my mind, sir. You're blowing my mind. The Target employee sent me over to the weird section. <laughs> That's where the Flintstones set was. <clears throat> um, cool. Nice. I get to build the cop car. Ooh, the cop car I've heard is a really cool build. So <clears throat> awesome. Hopper. Oh, yeah. Hopper is. Sheriff Hopper. Cop car. Sheriff Hopper. Did you know that Hopper's character is heavily influenced by Indiana Jones? Right. I did not know that. Nice. Now, now, have you watched Stranger Things? I have, yes. I've okay. only seen the first and second season. Okay. Um, the second there's the third one, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I haven't watched the third one. To me, the second season was a letdown compared to the first season. See, I didn't get on the whole Stranger Things bandwagon until the second season almost came out. So, um, 
it had come out when I was just watching the first season, so I was really excited because I could just continue on. So, uh, um, <clears throat> but yeah, I missed a lot of the hype. You know, yeah, yeah. When it um, first came out. Yeah, the first season I thought was really, really good. The second season stunk high heaven, but the third season uh, was almost at the same um, level of what the first season was. Oh, really? So yeah, so I felt they came back in the in the third season. Okay. Would you be be willing to watch the third season again? Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely. Let's so, add it to the list. Add it to the list of things to watch with you. So, um, <clears throat> you know, normally, you know that when I build Lego, I separate all my pieces out. <laughs> <laughs> and that didn't happen. Can't really do that here. We're just limited for spots, really. But no, uh, I'm just messing with you. It doesn't. I don't have to do it. Yeah. So, um, do you have to have one of these? I got one. I think this is the right color. At least I hope so. <clears throat> so, yeah, um, this is one of the sets that I've been really wanting. Yeah, um, you've been talking about it for a while. Oh, uh, yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm excited. Yeah. Uh, there was a, someone did a really cool mock of this type of thing before this set even came out. Oh, okay. Uh, cool. At Brick World. It was, like, huge. It was about the size of this table. And they built the house. And then you know did the the under oh, and wow. then it had it all lit up and it had like uh lights and stuff with it and it was it was amazing so that's kind of what it was based off of yeah right? all right so we got uh oh little sheriff guy here sheriff hopper sheriff hopper little coffee cup now he's kind of hard to see here <laughs> i don't have long enough arms to get it close enough to the nice. camera there so let's watch over us <clears throat> Uh, sorry, went AFK a bit to get the cake for Logan's birthday. Oh, well, happy birthday. Yeah, happy birthday. Uh, it was just your birthday just the other day. It was, yeah, on Thursday. Yeah, so well, happy happy belated birthday. Thank you, thank you. No problem. Uh, it's kind of cool that they, they use the the mid legs for the uh, for the kids in this set. Uh, the, the mid legs were actually introduced... And uh, during the Harry Potter minifigure series. Oh, okay. Because uh, if you look at a lot of the the, the kid legs, mm -hmm. you can't move their legs. Oh, yeah, you're right. I guess I've never... Oh, okay. Yeah, cool. so so they, so they consider these mid legs. Mid legs, because yep. they bend. So yep. he has some knees. Yep, well, yep. so uh, we, got, we got Will uh, right here. So here we go. <clears throat> so he gets stuck in the, the upside down, or the under, or is it the upside down or under? Um, upside, oh, down. upside down, upside down. Yeah. I'm drawing a blank. Uh, but yeah, it was cool that the the Lego store was able to do a store pickup like that. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I was really glad we got to take the trip down there and couple cool sets so uh yeah the disney castle there was one and i took a picture of the tag on the shelf because i couldn't believe it there are two targets in drumbull connecticut and one i went to had two sections really wow uh, i put a video and pictures on my instagram i'm telling you i couldn't believe it it would be awesome if i could score the castle at target because then i get five percent off of it oh yeah with your red card um that would be really cool <clears throat> So I wonder if I could go to the Target that's in uh, on State Street, right? Mm -hmm. Because that is considered... Like a super Target? As, yeah, it's called one of their super Targets. And I do know that they have different sections set up for Lego. So maybe, oh. maybe possibly um, they had the Disney Castle. Cause like, yeah, uh, maybe. That, I that's mean, if he's saying it's there, yeah. Because yeah, that, that's the store that I took Blaze to, and they had like the Flintstone sets and that. But, oh. You know, okay. they never carried it over at our Target because it's a smaller section. Yeah. Got a little bicycle here. And thank you, Winterbricker, for the birthday wishes. I appreciate it. <clears throat> birthday wishes. One happy birthday. I believe that's gray. Blue and gray, blue and gray. So hopefully everyone's having a good Saturday. It was kind of a, a nice day out. Uh, yeah, it was really nice out. It was a nice day for, for a ride. A little drive, yeah. Down to Gurney Mills. Oh, yeah. We went to, uh, yeah, the Lego store. We didn't go in or anything. We just drove right up, and the lady was waiting outside, handing some other 
goodies to another family. Yeah. So we didn't have to wait long at all. And uh, and she was really cool on the phone, too, because she was out of breath uh, when I called her to tell her that we were only about a half hour there. And she's like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm out of breath. But uh, we... Uh, I've been running things outside all day, so. And uh, she was the only one working, yeah, too. Right, and I forgot what her name was, unfortunately. And I apologize, otherwise I would have given her a plug on the, the channel because uh, she was awesome. Yeah, no, she was uh, very nice. Now, you know, like I told you earlier, I don't know if she was forced to go into work, but, uh, you know, it was very, uh, very generous of her to come in. Because they were only doing it for, like, uh, today and tomorrow, I think. Yeah. Yeah, they're not. And then uh, supposedly that store is supposed to be completely open by, um, was it the 6th? The 6th. Yeah. Yep. So. <clears throat> All right. So I got something going here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's my building so far. <laughs> uh, Sunday here, Logan's 18th birthday. Nice. Happy 18th. Yeah. 18. That's a, that's a good <clears throat> birthday. They make a pretty cool light kit for that set. Uh, yeah, um, I believe, um, um, what is it? Brick Loot. Brick Loot has the light kits for these. <clears throat> oh, for this set? Yep. Oh, cool. <clears throat> you know, uh, <clears throat> oh, man. I gotta get something to drink. I'll be right back. <laughs> <clears throat> righty. I'm not sure what I'm building here, but it's just like a... I guess it's just the sign for Stranger Things. Mm. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Oh, it looks like it's going to be a stand for all the figures to be on. Oh, yeah. That, yeah, okay. Kind of like uh, the Ghostbusters did for the, the Ecto-1. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, because they came out on a uh, stand and it had their, their logo on it. And so you had a spot for all them to stand on. Oh, okay. <clears throat> yeah. Only eight of those. And of course, I only see like three of them. All right. So that's kind of cool that they broke this up into two, you know, two books where you can. Uh, yeah. You know, if you want to do, do it the like this. Upside down world first. Yeah, uh, I was thinking that. I was like, what if we want to do the upside down world first? All right. Uh, what do we get here? It says uh, the flex mid legs are so much better. That was a great improvement. Yeah. Otherwise, you couldn't. To have kids sitting in anything. They always had to stand on it. <clears throat> it Me Juice says hello. Hi there. I think uh, I saw her um, or him. I'm sorry, It Me Juice. <laughs> <laughs> I can't really tell from the photo there. It's hard to tell. But, uh, yeah, they were there uh, last time, I think. Yep. On uh, uh, Let's Chat Wednesday they yeah, were. on Wednesday. <clears throat> nice to see the people. Uh, pretty handy. Talking about the, the mid legs. The mid legs. Yeah, so, you know, I I, I was kind of bummed that they didn't have the uh, the castle, but I was, yeah. I was pumped when uh, at least they had this one. Yeah, yeah, I know. This was on your uh, bucket list as well. Yep, definitely on my bucket list. So, so this set is basically uh, the one that you guys paid for uh, with our super chats. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <coughs> That's awesome. See if I get these here right. I don't think I do. Nope. I already messed up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Rut roll, Shaggy. Rut roll. Rut roll. I know they have a new Scooby-Doo movie. Uh -oh. I don't know how I feel about it, but it's called Scoob. <laughs> Rut roll, Raggy. Scooby Doo was definitely one of my favorite cartoons growing uh, up. I uh, would always wake up just in time from my afternoon nap to catch Scooby Doo in the afternoon. So. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Um, that was uh, uh, the you know the old school cartoon one because I know that they they kind of did a reboot with it and it wasn't all that good. Yeah. No, I'm talking about the old school, the OG yeah. Scoob. Uh, there's a episode of. Um, what was it? Supernatural, where they transform and get in, sucked into a Scooby Doo episode. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah, and uh, it's funny because uh, you know the the older brother, he's like he's like, oh my god, we're in a Scooby Doo episode, and they're like uh, trying to figure out who the murderer was. Yeah. And he's like, 
this is a cartoon. No one really dies. And this dude gets his head blown off and he's like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> How are you killing people on a you know cartoon? In a cartoon, yeah. yeah. So that was funny. Uh, starting to get humid here around New York, Connecticut, and Jersey. It got humid a couple of times. Um, Papa Bear, it was good. Addison cried. Uh, for for what? Uh, was he yeah, talking no, about? He had a comment up above. Uh, are we talking about the Scooby Doo movie? Uh, uh, no. No, I'm not too sure. Uh, it got, it, yeah, like I said, it got humid here a couple days ago. And then, uh, it kind of cooled off. Like, it doesn't know what it wants. It wants to be hot. It wants to be cold. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Because, yeah, like, yesterday was pretty chilly. Today wasn't too bad. Today was actually pretty nice. It was nice to go for a drive and... Get some Lego out of the deal. Yeah, get some Lego out of the deal. All right, so since this is your set, I'm going to let you do the stickers. Oh, okay. So. All right. Yeah, I haven't gotten... Oh, my God, and this is a big... It's the big one. Holy smokes. And where is it? So it's going to go like this. Well, this is the top. The top? Yeah. Okay. So. Holy smokes. I hate the, the tall stickers because you don't have a second chance on them. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's why I figured I will let you do it, because if I get it uneven, it's going to bother me, and then I'll just feel horrible because yeah. it's yours, and then you'll uh, he said, yeah, never Scoob. let me do it again. <clears throat> so the new Scoob movie is, is uh, sad, I guess. Yeah, I guess, if uh, Addison cried. Yeah, I haven't watched it yet, but. You know what? I think I got that. That was pretty quick. <clears throat> wow, look at that. I think I might have got that pretty good. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, looks yeah, good to me. Perfect. Perfect, my darling. Perfect. Perfect. <clears throat> some some Eartha kit some from uh, the old Batman TV show. <laughs> Which I think is probably one of the better Catwomans of all time was Eartha Kitt. When you get a woman that talks like a cat all the time, and <laughs> she plays a cat. So this is the little stand, I would imagine, for some of the figures here. And then um, in the book, it actually tells you like little facts about whatever you're building. This one just talks about uh, making references to Stephen King. Oh. One is the series logo. It resembles the font used on the covers for the original 1980s editions of Cujo and Christine, oh, Stephen King novels. Nice. So that's probably why that font looks familiar. <clears throat> oh, very cool. Yeah, I, I, I really love about the show is it throws back to a lot of the 80s stuff. Um, yeah. Uh, the, the references and stuff they do with it. Yeah, and growing up in the 80s. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Yeah, Gets you in the field, it. yeah. Uh, there's a lot of pieces to go on this. So I already got one thing done here, Nick. What about you? Um... <clears throat> I got something <laughs> done. Look at that. Look at that. Hey, that's it. That's very important. Yeah. It's the foundation. It's the foundation. For your upside down. Exactly. Plus, I think uh, my bag had more parts than yours. Um, But your parts look a little bigger than mine. <laughs> <laughs> Why, thank you. It's not a race. <laughs> oh, you got a pumpkin in your... In your I do, yeah. That's kind of cool. I know we had a pumpkin in the haunted house, too, in the little cemetery section. We got to build oh, a pumpkin. Yeah. If you recall, yeah, because uh, the hole for the uh, the the up or the upside down mm -hmm. is in a pumpkin patch. I Wait, think the, that I think what? that was <clears throat> to the, one of the portals to get to the to the upside oh, down okay. was in a pumpkin patch. Yeah, you know it's been a while since I've watched it, so but now that you mention that, it kind of rings a bell. Yeah, I, I want to say that was a second season. That was the pumpkin patch. But I could be wrong. I could be mistaken. <clears throat> you know, because I've only watched the, you know, each season once. Um, I'm, you know, would definitely, you know, if you wanted to watch the third season, I'd watch it again. But, I don't know. I, it's hard for me to go back to <clears throat> seasons and watch it. Oh, really? They've watched again? Yeah. There we go. 
Uh, very rarely. Maybe like I, w- I went through Friends a second time. Oh, wow. Like the whole entire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all the. All uh, the Friends is. All the Friends is. <clears throat> <clears throat> Man, there's a lot of, a lot of little pieces here. Man, I cannot shake this cough, so I apologize, guys. Winter Breaker says, I love the pop culture references. Uh, yeah. This is was a good score for you. I wanted to, uh, to Harry Potter clock tower for parts for Star Wars mock, actually. And I ended up with the Flintstone set. <laughs> so we both had strange buying experiences. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Siri kills my voice to text all the time. Yeah, that happens. That's okay, though. Papa Bear says, I like them, but they have to have a reason to be included. Uh, the setting <coughs> here makes sense. Man, okay. I gotta get water. <clears throat> all right. So, I am starting to build the, the cop car. <coughs> it's not really the cop car. It's the cop jeep, I guess. <clears throat> yeah, and I know that you know everyone has Netflix, right? And that you could watch Stranger Things whenever. Yes. Uh, but I still went out and bought this. Oh, nice! Just to uh, have it uh, because it looks like an old VHS tape. It does. Yep. And they had it on clearance for three bucks. Oh well, come on! You can't beat that. Right? I think it's. I think it might be DVD. No, it is Blu-ray. Oh, Blu-ray. Okay, because yeah, oh. I see it says VHS on the side there, so it's yeah. a throwback to yeah. the, the yeah, VHS. See, it says so. VHS right here, so it's that old '80s yeah. you know, throwback look to it. Oh yeah. So I had to order it. Of course. You know, for three bucks, you know, <clears throat> I think it was like That's one of those three dollars. Uh, yeah, three dollars. See. Nice. <laughs> um, it was on sale for three bucks. Where'd you get that? <clears throat> uh, Target. Target. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't see that they came out with a second season or third season with that look to it, because that would have been a cool little little collection. Yeah, on, on, the, on the shelf. All of them, yeah. Uh, the new version of the Dark Crystal on Netflix is pretty damn good. Uh, I haven't watched it yet. Uh, did you ever watch uh, the Dark Crystal? Um, yeah, you know, I've watched it like one or two times. I never really um, was. Got into it. Into it, really. I mean, it was fine. It's just, yeah. um, I was more like um, Labyrinth. You know, I would. Oh, yeah. Definitely more into like that movie. Uh, David Bowie, Rest in Peace. Definitely David Bowie. Oh, uh, yeah. That, you know, he, he played that character so good. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You know, I was pretty, um, you know, young when that movie came out. So, you know, I didn't know who David, David Bowie was. <laughs> so when I, you know, realized that he was, you know, an artist. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> right? That's the guy from the Labyrinth. Yeah, right? <laughs> uh, he wears the tights. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with, with a big old bulge. So, uh, <clears throat> yeah. That's a fun movie. Very cool. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I haven't seen uh, the, the new Dark Crystal, but everyone says it's really, really good. Were you a fan of the original movie? Um, <clears throat> It kind of creeped me out okay. more than anything. Um, really? Growing up, I had like this. Now Doc is probably gonna show up. I had a phobia of like uh, puppets and you know, <laughs> kind of stuff. You know, like Sesame Street freaked me out. Really? Yeah. <clears throat> I'm not laughing at that. I was laughing at the fact that you said Doc was gonna show up <laughs> and say you were afraid of puppets. <laughs> but wait, he's not a puppet. He's a. Uh, he's a whatnot. A whatnot. Yeah, uh, but yeah, um, like movies with like puppets creep me out. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, like there's, uh, certain parts of like never ending story that freaked me out. Really? Yeah. Huh. I don't know. It seemed like creatures, like costume creatures and stuff like that kind of always freaked me out. And I, I blame my mom <clears throat> and dad because they always got, hold on. They always got like rink side seats mm-hmm. for like, um, <coughs> The ice capades and stuff. Oh, okay. So you'd always go to those. Yeah, and they would like skate right up to you. Oh, and really? you're like, oh my god, freaking <laughs> these things are, are huge and crazy looking, yeah, right? Yeah. So. so. You just have a bad, uh, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. 
So okay. yeah, but I, I've shaken that phobia since then. Okay, well that's good. Yeah, you know, you know, one of my friends is a puppet, so <laughs> or whatnot. Or whatnot. Yes. Uh, he was disappointed. He did not win the T-shirt the other day. Oh. <clears throat> we'll have to make uh, Doc a little. Yeah, and we'll we'll get him a T-shirt, t-shirt. out. Sure. Yeah. I think he said four T or yeah, five. T. Yeah, yeah, five T or four T. I think he said five T because I was gonna go four T because my son wears a four T. <laughs> If you guys <clears throat> were humid than cold, that means here it's going to be cooler in the next couple of days. Yep. If you're on the East Coast, it's you got our humid weather today uh, that yep. we had a couple of days ago. Uh, the Adam West Batman stuff from when I was a kid is too funny. Uh, yeah, I, that's one of my favorite shows. I got actually the entire uh, series on Blu-ray. Really? Of the Adam West Batman. And if you noticed in the hallway, <clears throat> I have the old Adam West Batman figures. Oh, I guess I've never really stopped to <coughs> look at them. <clears throat> I got the Joker, I got the Batman, and I got Catwoman. Oh, cool. And then in my closet, I have the a, a huge uh, Batmobile. Hold on. I'm going to get because oh, really? I, I got to show it off. It's, it's awesome. <laughs> That's cool. <clears throat> Looks like I'm going to be done first, guys. <laughs> So, yeah, Stud says, yeah, the font was a total Easter egg by the Stranger Things brothers that made it. As a design nerd, I always love that. Stephen King used to use that font several times. But, yeah. Oh, look, look at, at that. that. The Batmobile. Yeah. And That's pretty cool. It fits uh, the six-inch figures. Okay. Uh, but, yeah, it's the old Adam West Batmobile. Nice. And I got, uh, you know, they have the, the figures listed on the back, and I got a few of them. Oh, Okay. Yeah, so that was a Christmas present a few years ago. That's nice. <clears throat> Never took it out of the box, though. You ever plan on taking it out of the box? No, no. no. That, that's a mint and box thing. Mint and box. I get it. Uh, do you have the movie, Nick? Um, what are we talking about? Oh, the Batman movie. Yeah, I've got the Batman movie, too. They did an Adam West Batman movie. Oh, okay. And it's got one of the best scenes in it. Uh, he's hanging down into, like, an ocean. And a shark gets a hold of his leg, mm-hmm. and so it lifts him up, and he's got this uh, rubber shark hanging out of his leg. He's, like, <laughs> hitting it, and then he reaches into his uh, belt and gets a shark repellent. Shark repellent. And starts, like, spraying it on the shark, and the shark just kind of falls off. <laughs> it was so campy. It's so awesome, though. Those campy movies. Yeah, that's such my uh, my sense of humor. Yeah. Mm. Uh, because I don't take things all too serious. <laughs> you don't say. No, no. No, you gotta. You can't take life too seriously. Right. Yeah, I gotta have a little bit of fun. Yeah, this is like Tetris. Trying to figure out. And I love Tetris, by the way. <laughs> figure out how these things go. Um, I used to have a roommate when I was like, you know, eighteen years old. I lived with a couple girls, and um, she had a, a Game Boy. She had a purple Game Boy, and she would. Um, beat my high score and then she'd like leave it on the kitchen table for me and I'd pick it up and then I'd have it for a little while and beat her high score and then we'd go back and forth so oh nice definitely a big Tetris fan uh you know I never got into Tetris uh, you know I you know yeah I've played it but it wasn't yeah, like it was like my it. thing um but I did like the uh we were talking about earlier the Dr. Mario yeah 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 Dr. Mario that's one game I, I really enjoyed I'd love to play it again um i downloaded one for my phone actually but you know it's not quite the same i mean no. I, I want the old school i think it was what on the super nintendo yeah is when it came out oh look at that i'm moving moving and moving I'm, uh, moving oh man i gotta grab another one of these it uses a lot of these i got a lot of these plates Uh, that classic Bronco is awesome. Yes, it is. Oh, I guess it's a Bronco. I called it a Jeep, but yeah, to be technically <laughs> correct. Right, be technically it correct. Bronco. It does look like the OJ Simpson truck. I, I didn't hear his answer, Jay. Am, am I unplugged? Huh? Hello? Hello? No? 
I'm still plugged yeah, in. Yeah, no, I'm I'm not sure. Um, yeah. So I don't know what Winter Breaker can't hear me. Can you hear me now? I said, can you hear me now? <clears throat> All right, at least I feel like my throat's back now. Okay, good. No, it's not the Rona. <laughs> I wasn't too worried about it. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be sitting six feet away. Uh, six feet away, doing the social distancing. I'm going to need another sticker here in a minute for a license plate. Ooh, paying for a sticker. Yep. So. Which reminds me, I got to get mine ordered <laughs> for my car. It expired. Oh, yours. Yeah. It your expired sticker. in actual uh, April. So. Oh. Yeah. Um, for I think if it's just a sticker, I think you can go to maybe some of the other like currency exchanges. I don't know if those places are still open and do it. Like, you know, there's some other places that do them. Oh, uh, yeah. Or you might be able to even do it online. Maybe. So take a look at that. I know that they're giving everybody uh, yeah, extensions. Yeah, so yeah, getting driver's license expired on Thursday, so. <laughs> All right. Um, I had to I have to go take a vision test, which seems silly because I have glasses, so. Uh, not you. I missed it. Oh, okay. All right. Thank you. <laughs> All right. So when you have a moment here. Oh, yeah. Uh, give me one second. No problem. <clears throat> it's so hard in this lighting to see between the dark blues, yeah. the, the blacks, yeah, and then the... the grays, and then these other light blue grays. It's weird. I would think that the halogen light would actually illuminate yeah. illuminate them a little bit. I can't find that piece. Uh, it's a one by four of that blue. A one by four? Yeah. So one by one, but... yeah. Can't find it. Uh, no, nope, that's not it. Huh. Weird. Weird. Can't find it. Oh, here it is. Okay. Boom. There it is. It was hiding. Look at There's two of them right next to each other. <laughs> of course. Jeez. That's how it works. Jeepers, mister. All right. Oh, Hoosier. Hey, Hoosier. Hey, what's going on, Hoosh? He says, great set. He says, uh, we're more than welcome to build on his stream. Oh, yeah. Um, so. Yeah, we'll, we'll hop over. Uh, let us finish this bag. Yeah, sorry, we didn't realize. Yeah, so. we, yeah, we forgot. We forgot it was Saturday. Sorry. <laughs> just got super excited. Yeah, yeah, just got super excited. And started building it. Uh, so if there's still a spot over, we'll we'll hop over there when uh, yeah. uh, we're done with these uh, first bags that we got here. I'm on bag six. I don't know what bag you're on. <laughs> Uno. <laughs> Jeez, you're so far behind. Oh, yeah. Well, I am waiting on a sticker here. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no worry. I can wait. Right. I can just move on. Uh, mm -mm -mm. What, what sticker do you so need? That is number nine, the license plate right in here. Uh, oh, man, I hate license plates. I hate putting license plates on. Number nine. They're always like the, the sticker isn't long enough to go with that entire plate, and you got to try to center it. Yeah, yeah, you definitely have to try and center them. It doesn't matter. It looks like upside down, upside down. But I like your technique with uh, using the brick breaker as the sticker. Mm, there you go. Uh, the sticker Older. applicator. Otherwise, your finger your fingers get in the way. Yeah, no, that's very true because then you get like that one little corner stuck on your finger. Yeah, and then exactly. It just, like, messes everything up. Yep. <clears throat> All right. We got reprimanded. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, get me going there. Oh. Now it's an eye of the tiger, and I'm ready to fight. <laughs> I'm in the zone. Auto zone. Oh my <laughs> Tonight's stream brought to you by AutoZone. <laughs> Get in the zone, AutoZone. <laughs> oh, 
AutoZone. Uh, speaking of AutoZone, you need to get your tire down up. You didn't get going to get that done. He says, uh, you're all good. I'd check and make sure there's a spot open before we end. Ah, very nice. Thank you very much. Thanks, Weaver. You are a gentleman and a scholar, sir. All right. Just trying to make sure because everything's looking all wonky here. Oh, pieces are starting to mingle. I think that one's yours. Uh-oh. Don't put your peanut butter in my chocolate. <laughs> Stay on your side of the table. <laughs> I'll try. I'm trying. Um, oh, there's two. Okay, now I see it. I got this. Ooh. And these go together like this. It's like a puzzle. Look at that. Like Tetris. Uh, but unfortunately, unfortunately, this is not going together. Oh, wait. Oh, they don't go together? Hold on. Like you thought? Yeah, it did. Wait, boom. Now it's together. Look at that. Ooh. This is, this is a lot of plating. Look at this. It is, yeah. That's crazy. I guess it's got to be sturdy. I mean, it is a rather large house, and then you got to flip it upside down. <laughs> yeah, and then it's got to be able to get support both ways, right? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> now I got the AutoZone song stuck in my head. <laughs> get in the zone, AutoZone. Sorry for you. <laughs> Oh, it looks like I'm going to need two stickers here. Oh, man. Stickers everywhere. I know. So these are going to go on. There's two of them, so they're going to go on this side. Okay. The they're number 13, the police sticker. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. Calling the police, police, police. All right. With oh. these ones, I go the sh from the bottom down then instead of across. Oh, because they slope yeah. to the, s or the slanted. The precision. Yeah, because if there's anything I hate in the world, it's effed up stickers. <laughs> a crooked sticker, I know. Because it seems like, you know, when you find uh, a set, you know, that's been used, uh, you, either you go to Facebook Marketplace or find it at Goodwill or whatever, oh, the yeah. stickers are always 95% are jacked. <laughs> yes, I can only imagine. Because the little kids probably do them and they just don't care. So, parents, don't let your kids put on stickers. Yeah. <laughs> You do the stickers. Yeah. You don't want your kids to do drugs? Don't let them put stickers on. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, Titanium J says he has uh, Tetris music stuck in his head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did, did Tetris have a song? The theme song, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I have it stuck in my head now, too, but it's kind of hard to actually, like, you know, verbalize. Oh, verbalize it. <laughs> Um, sing whatever you want you to gonna call it. You're going to sing it in the voice of uh, Kermit the Frog. Kermit, Kermit the Frog here. <laughs> I was trying to do my Kermit the Frog impression. Right <laughs> you hit it, though. You got it right on the spot. And then, <laughs> then you went back for more. And then, it, I just ruined it. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, you oh, should have should have stopped while you were ahead, yeah. <laughs> Kermit the Frog here. Rainbow Connection. <laughs> The lovers, the dreamers, and me. No, 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 no. It's copyright strike. Uh oh. Yeah, the mouse will come after me. The mouse. Disney. Oh, you're right. Because they they bought up uh, Jim Henson stuff. Man, there's just so many pieces. <laughs> it's it's like. We need 16,000 pieces here. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. Cool. They're yeah. all in bag one. And you have to like start at a certain point. Otherwise, you know. They're going to be off. They're yeah. going to be off. And my head's all wooey wooey. Well, I'm just working on my Bronco here. Broncos. Getting the. The Denver Broncos. Getting there, got the back going with the license plate, got the steering wheel in. So we could change it and make it a white Bronco, and then uh, you know Good. Al Cowling can be driving it with uh, <laughs> the juice in the back. Yes. 
Is that or is that too much of a reference for for us being older people? Well, I don't think you caught my OJ reference I made earlier. I don't think you heard it. Oh, did you? Yeah. Oh shoot. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like the OJ car. Oh, it's oh, not the right color, oh, but. Oh. How about, what was I doing? Good I didn't catch that. Listening skills. My listening skills are bad. I know. Fine. Bad boyfriend. I know. <laughs> I won't hold it. <laughs> oh. If I told you you had a beautiful body, would you hold it against me? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. So use that, guys. When Has you're that out, worked for you? When you're out dating. Yeah. If I told you if you had a nice body, would you hold <laughs> it against me? Tips from Daddy Brickhead. <laughs> Dating tips. Got some pink ones here. Now, remind me what these are called. Um, those are uh, snot bricks. Okay, I was going to say, are these the snot bricks? Because they have... Yeah, studs not on top. Studs not on top. Well, technically, well, well, there technically is a there's a on stud top. on top, but yeah. It's a snot brick. It just means that there's a stud... On the side. On the side. That's interesting. Yeah. I do like the pink, though. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> now, be, if you notice that a lot of, like, your, like, color bricks uh, that come in, like, dark sets like this are built on the inside of the build. Yeah. It's uh, little accents yeah. or something. Um, or that you don't see it at so all. So you don't see it at all. Yeah. They just have extra of that color. So they go in. Uh, it's their way of getting them used. Then why make them in the first place? <laughs> Because they've got too many. Right. <clears throat> it's fun trying to build stuff with a microphone in front of your face. I know, right? <laughs> uh, when we hop over to Hoosiers, uh, we have to drop the microphone, so. Yeah, no, I, I remember. Do you remember? The 25th day of September. <laughs> That's actually my mom's birthday. <laughs> the really? The 21st day of September. The 21st day of September is your mom's birthday? Yeah. Wow. It sure is. Happy birthday, Mom. So, yeah, I actually do remember that day. <laughs> Very cool. That's a song. I know. <laughs> uh, man, what yeah, I... For someone who says you don't sing very well or you won't sing, I remember when you were talking about when you were doing the songs for uh, Ghost Frickin' Talkin' or the... The stories, and one of them was like oh, a song. Oh, yeah. I hear you sing all the time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I do that sometimes. Why does this not feel right? This does not feel right at all. Now it's starting to feel right. All right. <laughs> <clears throat> mm, I think I got it. I like when things work out like they should. All right. <laughs> Nothing worse than having to tear apart a set because you missed a spot. Yeah. Well, I've, I've seen uh, the jiggle puff do that too many times. <laughs> He's the worst at it. Uh, she knows what she's doing. <laughs> oh, did we miss butt chop? Maybe yeah. say it three times to go up here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the like to His nose will start itching and I'll just have to come on and yeah. find out why. Yeah. You're like, somebody call the chop. Somebody call the chopper. Uh, but yeah, I'm excited to see uh, Butt Chop in Ghost Freaking Talking Gear. Yeah, definitely. Uh, so if you guys have not heard, uh, Winter Bricker was actually a winner. A winner, ladies and gentlemen, of a Ghost Freaking Talking t-shirt giveaway. And uh, she forwarded her prize to the chop. The Butt of Chop. The Butt of Chop. All right. Like I'm running out of room. Uh oh. This is a big base plate, man. That's what she said. 
<laughs> or is that your line? I can't no, say that. No, huh? that's my line. <laughs> How <laughs> dare you use my line? Whose line is it anyway? <laughs> What is the deal? She's having some issues. Yeah. Or maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, there you go. Yeah, look at this is a long. Oh, look at that. This is gonna be. Where the hell am I gonna put yeah, this? Yeah, I was gonna say you need to get a new <laughs> shelf. <laughs> you said you wanted some new shelves, right? Oh uh, yeah. Uh yeah. I need to take down that picture and put shelves over. Uh, I spoke to him earlier, but he was at work. He should pop out sometime soon, hopefully. I have Bat Lord art to talk to him about. Oh, nice. That's funny. <laughs> we were just talking about Bat Lord. Yeah, we were <laughs> talking about, yeah. The Bat Lord. All right, I'm going to need yeah. another sticker here. Two stickers, please. I'm never going to get done. <laughs> That's what I'm, the point. <laughs> oh, is this to slow me down? <laughs> Okay, so this is going to be a little tricky here. So this one, we're going to do number 15. Number 15. 16. So we'll start with 15, and then it's going to go on the left side like this. Ooh, so 15, and like... 16 is the other way, like that. All right, I got to figure out how this... I'm going to grab some more water here. <clears throat> All right. There we go. That's fifteen and sixteen. Fifteen and sixteen are on the brick. You're welcome. Now I'll she's over there doing that. Now I've got my chance to catch back up. <laughs> Spoke too soon. No, no, she's back. <laughs> welcome back, honey. Thanks, you missed me, huh? <laughs> oh, definitely. <laughs> Everyone was asking, where's Vanessa at? <laughs> I was like, oh, I'm sure she'll be back soon. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, it just seems like I'm just piling plates now. Looks like that. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like when we're doing our 8-bit uh, characters, we pile like two layers of plates on top of the bricks. Oh, really? Yeah, to give it a good solid base to hold on to. That's a tip from us here at the Big Head Family. Time is four. What? Gotta love those. <laughs> Especially like the complicated ones where there's like 12 steps. Yeah, and right. It's like times three. You're like, crap, I could have been doing all three of these at <laughs> exactly. the same time. Yeah, because they don't tell you. There's sometimes they don't tell you until like that last page. And right. it's like, oh, yeah. you were supposed to times this by three. It's like, really? I could have been pulling all these parts and doing it all at the same time. But no. Yeah, I know how that's uh, going to work. Legos. Legos. <laughs> There's an ego in here somewhere. There is, yeah. It was actually pretty cool looking. I wonder if it's going to be in my bag or your bag. Uh, I don't know. Uh, it'll probably be in your bags because... Yeah. Um, I think the two the two characters then on the box on the upside down is uh, Will and uh, the Demogorgon, oh, the Demogorgon yeah. which I'm excited for. Yes, you are. I'm pumped for that Demogorgon. Now I almost was like, I'll buy the set or buy uh buy just a Demogorgon by itself. <laughs> yeah, it is a pretty cool figure. I mean, I haven't seen it in real life yet, but it looks pretty cool. All right, so he's got a pumpkin in the back of his Bronco. Mm -hmm. That's where the pumpkin goes. Oh, very cool. Pumpkin. And it's K 
caged in there. Nicholas caged in there? Mm-hmm. Mm, okay. Have, have I ever told you my disdain for Nicholas Cage? No. Yeah, I hate Nicholas Cage. Not a fan. Huh? <laughs> Not a fan. <laughs> um, How come? Because Nicholas Cage plays Nicholas Cage in all the Nicholas Cage movies. <laughs> <laughs> If you watch any of his movies, he's like such an over actor, and uh, he plays the same character over and over again. Uh, even in uh, uh, the very horrible, uh, what is it, Con Air? Oh yeah, I can't. Say um, I seen it. He had a mullet, and he tried to do an accent, and it kept Ooh. going in and out. Oh goodness! <laughs> but he was still Nicolas Cage. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I. And you know what? And somebody also brought it up because I hate Nickelback as well. Yes, and, uh, I agree. And, yeah. and they're like, "All right, so you hate Nickelback and you hate Nicolas Cage. What do those two things have in common? It's the name Nick in it." Yes, <laughs> I'm like, and they're like, "Do you name. just do you just hate <laughs> things uh, that have your name?" I'm like, you know what? Well, now that you now that you it. mention it, I can be the only one. <laughs> <laughs> so you know, I built a lot of cars because my son. Mm-hmm. Um, but this one is, is actually kind of cool. Like the back window here, you know, you, I'll take it apart and show you, you know, you build it up like that and then you put it sideways in here and it connects to the little, uh, oh. thing in there. Very cool. I thought that's a neat little, yeah, you know, it's not a, your typical building style for a, for, for a window. window. Yeah. Very cool. And I know we were just talking about, um, I was looking at the friend's set and you were talking about the floor, like the oh, rug. The, the rug is a like total side then, build. Yeah. yeah. The side build. Yeah, that friend said is awesome. All right, so maybe I got all the pieces on here that I needed for that page. I don't know. There were sixteen hundred pieces that went on the, <laughs> on that step. Well, my uh, pieces are getting smaller here, so slowly getting there. Uh oh, I'm just about done. Well, you had a lot bigger pieces, <laughs> so that's. Uh, that's what I'll tell myself I was going to say it sounds like excuses (laughs) to me but you know I'll let it slide whatever makes me sleep better at night give it to me there we go Uh, but yeah this this set looks really cool you know I seen it like in person at the store back in the day before you know the world destroyed itself. Now, was it built in the store or was it just in the box? No, it was built in the store. Okay. It was like in the display case and it looked really cool. So I'm like, man, I gotta have it. Good it. Yeah. Good it. All right. All right. And, you know, seeing I, I saved a lot of money not going to Brick World this year. So I'm like, well, what the Justifying heck? Justifying it, yeah. So I go into Brick World, I'll buy the set. Now, Brick World is canceled. When was that? I forget. Uh, that would have been in two weeks. Oh, okay. So, yeah. That's definitely uh, Father's Day weekend. <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah, that's right. I remember you talking about that before the, the Rona. Uh, they put the character 11 minifig in bag 11. Ah. Oh, look at that. Stupid stuff designers do. Ah, <laughs> very cool. Stupid. Well, it's just a little nod, right? Yeah, it's Little wink, wink. Yeah. For the the true hardcore fans out there. Yeah. All right. So, hold on. Oh, rut roll, Raggy. Uh oh. Sounds like someone's gonna have to take apart all his pieces. <laughs> Did you mess up? No. No. no I I just didn't put this piece on earlier. I'm like, why do I got a one by three that's extra? <laughs> I used to hide men's genitals in the flower bouquet on a famous spray aerosol brand. Oh, no. <laughs> that's just like, um, I don't know if you've seen on the little mermaid. Oh, yeah. The, uh, the, the castle. The like, phallic symbol. Yeah, the phallic yeah. symbol in the castle. Yeah. I got caught once by <laughs> creative director for doing it. Almost lost my job, but he thought it was funny because I would take uh, them the monotone color of the flowers or make them the monotone color of the flowers. Jeez. 
That's funny. Uh, that's too cool. Well, at least you didn't lose your job. Right. <laughs> the client was a jerk and I was young. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, to be young and dumb. <laughs> I wonder if anybody else like noticed that or if, you know, you just totally got away with it. <laughs> right. Well, besides, you know, your boss finding out, but that's pretty cool. And I think there was actually a couple other Disney um, yeah. movies that had other things on them, not yeah. necessarily phallic symbols. Yeah, it was like uh, in The Lion King when Simba lays down and the leaves uh, yeah, the start puffa, puffing yeah. out. It actually spells sex. Yep, I've, I've heard that one. And then uh, on Aladdin. Aladdin, yep, that was another um, one. Uh, if you turn it up loud enough, you hear uh, uh, the genie say, kids, take off your clothes. That's right. Okay, yep, that's the one. I haven't heard that personally, but I remember hearing, you know, that was in the movie. Mm -hmm. Now, have you heard these things or seen them? Personally? Oh, yeah, yeah, I've seen okay. them, yeah. Oh. Man, I got two extra pieces. Okay. I got a one by one uh, tile, and I got a one by one circular tile. Okay. Are you sure you didn't forget them somewhere? Uh, no. I'm pretty sure those are probably extra, but it, it looks like they use these just for gribbling. So I could just probably place them on there at the end of the build anyway, because it looks like they're used for like racks. Oh, okay. Because uh, gribbling is uh, like when you add uh, like accents to a little build. features. Little features to yeah, a build. You mentioned gribbling when I was doing my water oh, yeah, that's right. on my frog build. Uh, Photoshop is dangerous in trained hands. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this is Sheriff. I, I'm the Sheriff, and I got me some coffee. He does have himself some coffee. Dun, 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 I didn't know that they uh, inspired his character by Indiana Jones. That's funny. Yeah, yeah. Look at all the stuff that you'll find out. In, yeah. Uh, so, so uh, waiting for me here. No, no, it's fine. Uh, sorry, eating hot wings and they're messy, says Winterbricker. Uh, thanks, Winter. I'm going to go over there. I figure he would be in there at some point. Uh, so I wonder, uh, what does the room look like for Hoosiers? Seeing as I'm, we're being bad YouTube people tonight. <laughs> naughty, naughty. Naughty, naughty. I'm stepping out of my, uh, my league here. Uh, passport overused two days ago said my cat is adorable. <laughs> yeah, your cat was just chilling in that stream. Uh, Stud Sidious on think? the last stream said uh, your PlayStation went space balls ludicrous speed. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Oh, looks uh, like there's a spot. Alright, so looks like we have who's your spot. So whenever. So it looks like we'll hop over on Hoosier Stream. Yep. Once you're uh, done with the uh, the car here. No pressure. And no pressure. A g oh, Demi Gorgon. I, I forgot that he was there, and I kind of looked up. I was like, "What is like, that? What's that? What is that over there?" He's coming to get me. He's coming to get me. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, we will be heading over to Hoosier Stream here in, in a couple minutes. Um, seeing as we were being bad uh, YouTube friends tonight. <laughs> I totally forgot today was Saturday, to tell you the truth. I'm sorry. Yeah, the week was kind of thrown off with, like, Monday being a holiday. Oh, definitely. And then, um, yeah. All that stuff. All that fun stuff. All that fun stuff. Oh, did you know that the Hawkins Police Department vehicles and uniforms were inspired by those used in Jaws? Sweet. Nice. Yeah. You know, Jaws is in my top ten movies of all time. That's awesome. Definitely yeah. a good movie. Yes. I, I, you know, this is one of those movies when I was a kid I watched over and over and over again. Okay. Yeah. That was cool. that was on heavy that rotation. Was yeah. Uh, my dad was definitely, well, actually, Jaws was um, the first movie my mom and dad went on a date oh, very back cool. in the day. It was, what, 1975, I guess. Yeah. And, um, yeah, so my dad would always watch Jaws. So, yeah, I grew up watching Jaws. So. Nice. Uh, yeah. yeah, it. You know, I think that's why my infatuation with sharks came from. Was probably okay. should probably Jaws. Makes sense. 
but yeah, it was Jaws, uh, Ghostbusters, Gremlins. Um, I'm trying to figure out. There was a fourth movie that you know was just a constant rotation. Um, and now I can't think of what it was. My favorite movie growing up was uh, Wizard of Oz, and I watched it so many times I wore out the VHS tape. Oh, um, Back to the Future. Back oh, to okay. The future. Back yeah. to the future. Those were my go-to's back in as a kid. Doc, I have to tell you about the future. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I am done, and I All just right. have some extra. So, so what did you here. build in bag one? You built a a truck, I built and I built the base for the. Uh, was it the upside, un- down. upside down? I want to keep calling it the under. Upside down. Ah, so there we go. The upside so down. Yeah, this is a fun little build for a yeah, little Bronco. Yeah, it's a sharp looking car. Yeah, it actually had some, you know, building techniques I've never used before. I've never seen. So yeah, it was that's awesome. Kind of fun. I'm I'm interested to see how it connects. Is there like something? On, oh, I, okay. Now I see. It's probably held on with the uh, those. Uh, Bases with the prongs on it. Oh, okay. And you probably it just snaps, snaps in there. it in there. So when you turn it upside down, the truck's not going to fall off. Okay, cool. All hey right, guys. Well, uh, tune in over at Hoosier Stream. We are going to be heading over there right now uh, if there's room. If not, we will be back here uh, working more bags on Stranger Things. So, all right, guys. Make sure to subscribe here on YouTube and hit that notification bell for when new videos come out. Also, make sure to check us out on Facebook and Instagram. We have fun stuff. It's there as well. All right. Thank you, Vanessa, for, for setting in here and thank uh, you. doing the duel and losing. Oh. I'll get you next time. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, Hey, we got another bag. The night is young. Oh, okay. So. <laughs> okay. We'll, we'll, we'll uh, battle on bags two but, and seven. You know, we should have battled on your bag to my bag two, your bag oh, 13 or whatever oh, yeah. it was, because I'm going to be building the oh, yeah. base. Okay. Basically the same thing that you just built, just yeah. in different colors. Oh, all, it's all about the base. So you have to experience how this base went. Yes. It's, and I'm going to smoke you. Oh, you're going to smoke me? Okay. <laughs> all right. Big talk. <laughs> all right. All right, guys. All right. Uh, See you guys. As always... Brick time is family time. Brick time is family time. Uh, good evening. Goodbye.